Hello, welcome to my little impromptu Kenshi guide. Uh, I say impromptu just because I'm already on day 11, I already have 9,000 and I already have three people. But I did the bog standard start where you start with one guy and he's just him with a thousand cats and they changed the spawn. So the last time I played this game you started in this city, hence why I'm here. But um, you started in the hub or maybe Squint, I can't remember, either one of these two. And basically all I did was set a move order and ran up here to a town I already knew. Now the way I start this game myself is I watched a guide and I watched the guy mine copper and then he bought himself a house which is one of these houses for 20,000 cats after farming all that copper. He then got a research bench and got a guy to make armor until he was armor level, armor smithing 25. Um, from armor smithing 25 you can make shoddy grade or s not shoddy grade, the one up from shoddy grade. And you can sell that back to the vendors here and then buy the resources to and from, to and from and you'd just make a profit. Um, it was pretty simple. But the way the guy started out was he was mining copper manually and I thought I'm really fucking lazy and I cannot be bothered to do that. So this is my little guide on how I have automated this system. <laughs> I mean, I say automated, I'm not very knowledgeable. Uh, I just wanted to show this super lazy way to make money if you're just starting out and you really can't be bothered. So. Um, I started in one of these towns here and I just did a move order, so now I'm here. I start with my one guy who had, I mean running here he got 27 athletics on his own. Uh, he didn't have a backpack either, but I have one of those. Um, so basically all I did was mine copper until I got said backpack. Um, bought the backpack, mined some more copper, sold it to this vendor here. Um, I'm going to mention right now though that I do have a few mods on, one of which is the vendor mod to increase how much they, how much money they have and how much quantity they have, um, just just to make things a little easier. I mean this game is a little bit slow to begin with, um, training your guys up if you're going to do it legitimately is uh, it's, 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 it's a bit slow. So yep, I started with the one guy, I bought myself a backpack and then I carried on mining copper with the one guy and then I bought myself a little shack one of which to put a research bench in and the other one I bought another one to put the copper storage um, and then from that I then started to uh, get the storage uh, I, I got the research bench show research um, I've already researched it now I don't don't know if you can see the history that you've researched but I there's a bunch of storage ones that you do for free they, they don't require research books so I did the storage ones and then built myself a copper storage and it was super 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 in, like easy from here basically I'm not sure if you can mine more than one copper and haul it at once but um, this is my guy and I don't want he's like gonna be like my researcher so I didn't want him to be like dying um, this is super AFK however you will probably have a guy die every now and again so you might have to load a save um, especially if you're being as lazy as I am I haven't got these guys any gear except the, like this I found off a dead guy uh, stolen from a caravan drone so yeah um, I haven't got anything none of my guys have any weapons they just as they come um, so I actually haven't done anything else other than this I'm on day 11 I honestly just watched six episodes of that kingdom on Netflix and it was great um, <laughs> So I've just been doing this, it's super super like chill, but yeah, right, so basically all I did was yada yada, buy these two these two things, uh, put the research bench in, got, got the copper storage, I've said that, <laughs> uh, and then um, all I did was I shift right clicked on here, so, he, so these two guys uh, haul to the storage copper, and then what you do is you get one of them on this mining resource here and the other one there only there's only one worker allowed so you shift right click here and off he goes and then you do the other one and off he goes you speed up time so off they go they're just they're just gonna keep they're just gonna mine and then what they what they should do is they will mine one here we go so if I look at this one uh, they're gonna mine and then run it back in so then I have one guy waiting here already just to come pick it up with a backpack and then go and sell it into the uh, <laughs> go and sell it into the, the vendor. So this is like a super impromptu AFK copper mining money making like super big like beginner 
like to just the just the AFK farm because I really cannot be bothered to go around and farm all these skimmers. Uh, I also increase like the nests, uh, like the nest multiplier, so you get loads and loads of enemies like mobs coming. Um, a thing that you could do, uh, because it's like a 10 minute auto save feature, you could lower that to like 3 minutes, so auto saves every 3 minutes, and then just do something else, come back, if you've got a guy that's dead, if you do, can't be bothered to go and nurse him back to health, then just reload the auto save, you wouldn't have lost too much copper. And yeah, it's super, super chill, super easy, and yeah. If you enjoyed this, um, please just just give me a like. You know, just just want to like. Thank you very much.